Hi there, it's me, Logan, and it's time for This Week in History, where we learn about some of the most important historical events that have taken place during this week of the year. This week has lots of historical events, including the final day of Julius Caesar, the patent of the cotton gin, and St. Patrick's Day, just to name a few. Before we begin, I ask for your support by giving this video a thumbs up because it helps my educational channel grow. Finally, don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you never miss any of my fun and historical videos. Ready? Let's learn about This Week in History, March 14th through the 20th. March 14th On March 14th, 1794, Eli Whitney received a patent for his new invention, the cotton gin. The patent for the cotton gin in 1794 revolutionized cotton processing, significantly impacting the economy and social structure of the antebellum South. The invention mechanized the separation of cotton fibers from seeds, exponentially increasing productivity and profitability in cotton cultivation. Prior to the cotton gin, this process was labor-intensive and time-consuming, limiting cotton production. However, the patent's impact was mixed. While it boosted cotton production, it also intensified the demand for slave labor, exacerbating the institution of slavery in the United States. Despite controversy and subsequent legal battles over patent infringement, Whitney's invention played a pivotal role in shaping the economic landscape of the early American South. March 15th. The end of Julius Caesar came on March 15th, 44 BCE also known as the Ides of March. A group of senators, led by Brutus and Cassius, conspired against Caesar, fearing his increasing power and perceived tyranny. On that fateful day, Caesar was ended in the Senate chamber. This event ignited a series of political upheavals, ultimately leading to the end of the Roman Republic and the rise of the Roman Empire under Augustus. Caesar's final day remains one of the most infamous and debated episodes in ancient history, resonating throughout the ages. March 16th On March 16, 1945, the United States Marines achieved a pivotal victory in World War II by capturing the island of Iwo Jima. The grueling battle, marked by intense combat, lasted over a month. Despite facing formidable Japanese defenses, including an intricate network of tunnels and fortified positions, the Marines demonstrated unparalleled courage and determination. Their perseverance culminated in the raising of the American flag atop Mount Suribachi, an iconic moment immortalized in an iconic photograph. The capture of Iwo Jima provided a crucial strategic foothold in the Pacific theater, paving the way for further Allied advances towards Japan. March 17th We have a two-for-one history special on March the 17th, because there's two important events taking place. First is the holiday of St. Patrick's Day. St. Patrick's Day, celebrated annually on March 17th, commemorates the patron saint of Ireland, St. Patrick. It's a festive occasion marked by parades, parties, and the wearing of green attire worldwide. Originating as a religious feast day in the 17th century, it has evolved into a global celebration of Irish culture and heritage. Iconic symbols such as shamrocks, leprechauns, and pots of gold adorn festivities. In addition to its cultural significance, St. Patrick's Day serves as a time for communities to come together, revel in joy, and embrace the spirit of Irish pride. Our second historic event on March 17th happened in 1992, when South Africa witnessed a historic moment with its apartheid vote. This crucial decision marked a significant step towards dismantling the discriminatory apartheid regime. The vote symbolized the collective will of the people to end the oppressive system of racial segregation and inequality that had plagued the nation for decades. Through democratic means, citizens actively participated in shaping the future of their country, fostering hope for a more inclusive and equitable society. March 18th. The Isabella Stewart Gardner Museum art heist remains one of the most notorious unsolved crimes in history. On March 18, 1990, two individuals disguised as police officers gained entry to the museum, stealing 13 priceless artworks, including works by Vermeer, Rembrandt, and Degas. The heist shocked the art world, leaving behind empty frames and an enduring mystery. Despite extensive investigations and substantial rewards offered for information, the stolen pieces have never been recovered. 
The incident sparked debates on museum security and the vulnerability of cultural treasures. Today, the empty frames serve as a haunting reminder of the brazen theft. March 19. On March 19, 1931, a historic moment unfolded in Las Vegas as the legalization of gambling was signed into law. This pivotal decision marked a significant milestone in the city's illustrious history, signaling a new era of economic growth and cultural evolution. With the move, Las Vegas solidified its position as a global hub of entertainment and gaming. While debates surrounding the social and economic impacts continue, there's an undeniable sense of excitement that comes with gambling in Las Vegas. March 20th. On March 20th, 1999, Bertrand Picard and Brian Jones etched their names in aviation history as the first to circumnavigate the globe nonstop in a balloon. Their journey, aboard the Breitling Orbiter 3 spanned 19 days, covering over 40,000 kilometers. Facing treacherous weather and technical challenges, the duo showcased remarkable perseverance and ingenuity. Their achievement marked a triumph of human spirit and technological innovation, pushing the boundaries of what was thought possible in aerial exploration. Picard and Jones's daring feat not only inspired future generations of aviators, but also symbolized the boundless potential of human determination in conquering the skies. That's it for this week in history, March 14th to the 20th. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I ask you to please subscribe to catch all my upcoming videos. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up before you head off, and thank you again for watching. Until next time, never stop learning.